mercies to Aaron, to the isle I love so well. Today is the day I'm finally going to hike a mountain I wanted to do for years. I'm on the Isle of Arran and I'm so excited to do this hike. Currently we're on uh, North Sanex Burn hiking through the glen to get to the top of this mountain and uh, we're going to capture a sunset. We have reached the point where we can go two ways. Either we're gonna do a long route along the ridge over to the mountain, or we're gonna do a little scrambly section, which is just behind us. There's another one or two routes that we can do, but we're not really sure yet which route we're gonna do. made it to the top of the ridge behind me is another summit which is 660 meters high and we could have done that route but we didn't do it we came down from the glen there and then just on the other side is north of Goatfell there's another summit called North Goatfell and then if you go down there there you have the saddle and it looks amazing the geography in this area is out is no words for it The sun is gonna set in half an hour and we have some beautiful golden glow on the mountains. Sadly, the clouds have disappeared in the distance, but we can't change anything to that. It is a beautiful evening and I'm hoping that the mountains will catch a really nice red glow just over the peaks and it should probably happen in 10 minutes. There is a bank of clouds on the horizon. I think actually that's gonna disturb the sun and remove the light but that doesn't matter because we still have some amazing light right now Now that was a beautiful sunset, the glow became quite red but it got caught off by the bank of cloud in the distance but it doesn't matter, it was really beautiful glow and I think I managed to capture a really beautiful image which there's a crater on the right bottom and it looks like it's a volcano itself and then in the distance you have the mountains which were created by all these magnificent events, ice age volcanoes, everything. The moon is out as well. It's a beautiful evening. So I'm gonna find a spot 
to to do some bivvying for the night and wake up for tomorrow morning i think just behind me there there's a few spots where you can go under the rock and lie under the rock so if it was to be raining i'd be dry under the rock so that's probably where i'm gonna set up my bivy spot What a spectacular morning. There was definitely a small inversion. There was a lot of mist in the, in the valley there. Behind is Glen Rosa, so there's where all the mist came in. It was forecasted that it would the east side of the mountains will be potentially be covered in mist and it materialized. A beautiful morning. At first I thought there might be no sunrise for them behind me. A sunrise happened there there was a gap a beautiful a beautiful sunrise and an amazing amazing mountain wow like you still see some light just all over the ridge line the other corbets such a beautiful morning mm -hmm. 